Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Dead Island 2. While launching the game, you get a black screen and the game is crashing at the top. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. Click on start menu and type in control panel. Open the control panel and click on the option power options. Now here from the left pane, click on the option create a power plan and then you need to choose the option power saver. Give it any name you want and then click on the option next. Click on the option create. This will create a custom plan. Select this particular plan and then try to launch the game. If this failed to work out, right click on start menu, choose option device manager. Now expand your display adapter. From here, you need to disable your integrated GPU. It must be either AMD Radeon graphics or Intel SD graphics. So right click on that and choose option disable device. After disabling it, launch your Epic Games launcher, go to a library, click on three dot icon next to a game and choose the option manage. Now right over here under the launch options, if this particular option is turned off, you need to turn it on and in the space provided, you need to type in minus DX11. Once you done so, close it. Now go ahead and try to relaunch the game and this will completely fix out the issue of black screen at launch or the game is crashing at the startup. Now if somehow you are able to launch the game, you will find an option of AMD Fidelity FX Super Resolution 2 or you can see FSR. If you are able to launch the game, make sure you turn off this FSR feature right into the graphic settings and this will resolve the black screen issues in the game. Now once the game is launched, click on the options and then choose option display. Now in the display settings, scroll down and click on the option advanced. Again scroll down and you will find the option of FSR. So if you are able to launch the game, make sure you turn off the FSR feature and then relaunch the game. And this will completely fix out the issue of black screen while playing the game. And if nothing works, I have a temporary fix. To do so, right click on the start menu, choose option run type services.msc and then hit the enter key. In services menu, press the W key to find a service with the name Windows Audio. Once you find a service, right click and choose option stop. One more thing friends, once you stop the Windows Audio service, the windows of your system will be completely stopped until you again come right over here, then right click and choose the option enable. This is only a temporary fix until the developer of the game provide you a new update to resolve the issue. So if you really want to play the game, right click and choose option stop and then try to launch the game and hopefully the game will be started. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.